Hello, in this video we're gonna check how all gestures and motions work in Motorola Moto G73. And to do this we'll need to open our settings. Now find the gestures, there should be right here in the display wallpaper, sound vibration, notification. Tap, then enter it, and inside we can find all of the gestures and motions. Now let's check how they work. First one is freeform apps and if you enable it you will get this line right here which allows you to scroll down uh, something like this with uh, all of the shortcuts which you can customize with the button right here what's, what icons are visible there. So that's nice and works fine. Next one is system navigation. Right here you can pick how you will navigate through your phone either with gestures then it hides these buttons and you need to basically use uh, your finger uh, with different uh, swipes to navigate and there's also three buttons then you will see the three buttons at the bottom and you can navigate your phone with that you can also click on the settings to customize uh, the assistant on okay so there's no uh, customization for the buttons how they look okay next option is uh, one-handed mode if you enable it then you'll be able to scroll, oh, you need to enable it right here first. You'll be able to scroll down notification bar by just uh, swiping down right here. It uh, helps you navigate your phone with one hand. Let's go back. Put display to sleep and if you enable it, then you can double tap to put display to sleep when you're on a home screen or lock screen. So keep in mind this doesn't work anywhere else and we just need to go to our home screen, double tap and the device will lock. Next one is uh, jump to lock screen and when display is sleeping you can double tap to jump to the lock screen and sleep mode looks like this so when you have uh, the screen all black then you can double tap and it should wake up your phone like that. Next one, wake display, use gestures to wake up your display and I don't see any difference right here between uh, the other two settings but um, let's try it. So only thing you can change here is tapping the display or moving the phone so let's go with moving the phone and choose option double tap jumps to the lock screen or moving the phone turns display on and yeah let's try that yeah I don't get this feature sorry you can try it if you like uh, for me it's kind of weird okay next is three fingers screenshot now you just need to place your three fingers onto the screen and you'll make a screenshot that's quite simple uh, swipe to split and here if you perform something like this uh, you'll be able to open two apps at the same time and have one right here and one on top Let's use the try it out because I think you need to be somewhere else and here you can see the little presentation. So it works like that. Uh, next one is physical key tab and here we can double press power key to launch a camera. This works fine, just double press and here's the camera. Press and hold power button to launch assistant. If you enter it you can adjust the press and hold duration. and. Yep, it works like that, you have the assistance called out. Media controls, you can use volume buttons when uh, you listen to some music or uh, watch a video, but actually it works on lock screen, so it's kind of pointless on uh, to watch a video. But you'll be able to play next or previous track by just pressing on the volume key. Quick launch, and here you can double tap to back trigger to custom uh, to pick the custom app to open you can go for the settings and here select whatever you want so we have a screenshot let's try it out it works fine next is fast flashlight if you perform something like handshake with your phone it should enable the flashlight 
I always have problems with this. Last in last video it actually worked, but now it doesn't. Let's try locking on phone. Maybe then it will work, but it doesn't. You can try it if you like. Uh, let's move on. Next option is a lift to unlock. You can unlock your phone by just lifting it and looking at the camera. And it, uh, it's basically face unlock and uh, you need to set up your face and lock as well for that so yeah it's, it's just the same thing for me at least pick up to silence you can enable it and then if you receive any call you can pick your phone and uh, the call should be muted last option is flip to dnd and if you flip your phone over so that the screen touches the surface um, all calls and uh, messages or notifications will be muted and it works basically like the disturb mode and that's all of the gestures on this device and that's it for this video hope you like it please consider subscribing to our channel leave a like and a comment below